Do you like TRX Force? Because I do. Intro. What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It is your favorite bearded beauty back here at Bowman Built RC. Okay, so to continue on with all the things I've been doing. So what happened was the red Ford that you've seen that I took down to South Carolina in the video where I go in the creek and everything, I pretty much took it to as far as a DRX4 would go. It had all aftermarket axles and everything. What smells? Ugh. Something that smells like onions. So, I took it as far as I could take a TRX4 with a stock chassis. And then I got this body, and it was pretty cool. I painted it. I painted it all with uh, rattle cans. You know, all that jazz. It's all marble and stuff. Here's a here's a picture of what it looked like right when I had painted, painted it. Uh, right when I painted it. What I did was I got a scatter gun in WSD Velcro. Velcro body mounts for all my haters. I'm looking at you, Jordan. It has a Bauhaus uh, low profile skid on it. Everything was, I mean, it's basically just all yeah racing, underdrive, underdrive in the rear, overdrive in the front. It has a lot of dirt on it. CI foams, Thornbirds. I did cut them, so I stagger cut these, cut half of the small lugs out on the rear, and then I took the front little chunks and then uh, took half the little bars out in the front. They work really well in the mud, like really, really well. Uh, the scatter gun is really nice. Uh, I have no complaints about it. I did try to keep the two speed. We were running out of time. I fabbed up this little mount for the micro servo. It sucks. It basically sits there and chatters until it falls into gear. I don't like it, but I'm going to have to figure something else out. I'll probably move it in more in line or something. Velcro body mounts. I made this. The shocks. Uh, these are stock T-Rex 4 shocks in the front. The rears, I believe, are like G-Maids or something. They came on it when I had it. I made this little front bumper. Got the DSM winch on there. This thing has a 3800 castle geared all the way down as low as it'll go with the two speed. I have aluminum sliders that I had on the Ford body, but I chopped them off to fit the Colorado. And then I made this little whale tail thing uh, that kind of sits under the rear. So it slides, it's almost like a slider, basically slides up into the rear bumper and the bumper sits right above it. Worked really well. I didn't get, you know, hung up on anything. The only problem is just the tires. Uh, the tires, they either need softer foams, and I think these need to break in. I want to say they're hard in the rear, medium in the front. Uh, I need to go back and vent them. They're not vented. Mamba Spectrum front bumper, like I said, comes out in all that jazz with the winch. I really liked it. If the tires work better, I would love it. Uh, it is definitely one of my favorite trucks which I can keep saying forever because I don't keep anything that I don't really love. I get bored and that's why I have 40 bazillion trucks because I cannot do what some of you guys can and just continue driving the same truck every single time I go out. It makes my brain hurt. So onward. So this is my son's truck. A little, little fady paint. You know, this was my old one nine Wraith. I, just kind of threw something together for him, thinking that he's just gonna wanna drive in circles. And this, these damn Amazon shocks, these things, I mean, I know they're $20 Amazon shocks, but God, they're junk. But for a three-year-old, they're super cool, whatever, okay? So I built this, he loved it, drove it around. I took him to a place where we have comps here locally dude was hooked like i'm talking teach me teach me how to drive this thing literally just telling me teach me how to drive this hey looking at my friends hey jordan can you teach me how to do this can you help me he's trying to take this thing well not this thing but this was 
down because he broke the shocks everywhere. So, we put that in the car. And we pick up my spare. This is just a spare TRX4. I literally picked this up for dirt cheap, like 200 bucks with, it needed a receiver. The guy told me it ran and drove and uh, it needed a receiver and then also didn't have a pinion or a spur in it. And he was like, oh, I'll let you drive it for real. I should have taken him up on that, but whatever. So anyway, took this out and it has RC4 wheel drive, older boggers on it. It does not get traction very well, but I know it's durable and he can't break it. This dude was trying to take this thing up lines like you'd take freaking comp trucks up and everything like this deep ass V that's all wobbly. And he's kind of, I said, buddy, I don't think that truck's going to make it up there. I think you may have to go a different way. He goes, I don't want to. I want to take it up that line. We admire your attitude, my friend. So this is now his new truck. I'm probably going to take the Hyraxes and the uh, Chanquish methods off of the tuber, put it on here. Lower it a little bit. We'll probably give him a new body because he really doesn't like this one. And it's real big and bulky. And if I can make it a little bit better. And then he is going to comp with this. What is that? Novice class kids. They do like a class two newbie kind of thing. Pretty much just a basic stock TRX4. I have it. I have the axles locked, but it still does have selectable uh, first and second gear. He knows to put it in first gear whenever he's doing something. He just drives the balls off this thing. Works great. It's got a Trailmaster Sport or a Crawlmaster Sport, whichever one the green one is, and a Hobby Wing 1080. Cheap ass Amazon servo. It works great. This is his new little truck. Then you got this thing. My daughter also wanted to have a truck. And then now she wants to comp with me and my friends and her little brother. I built her an SCX 10, and this girl broke every single freaking thing on it. I'm not joking. Put a hobby wing in it, she smoked the motor. Okay, cool. So now I bought her a, a home sport, little Crawlmaster Sport, Trailmaster, whichever one. Put it in there. She smoked a 1080. It had some sort of drag in it. Put a whole new transmission in it. Then she breaks the front drive shaft. Okay, that had just big board or wild boards on there. All right, cool. I'll buy you some metal like Amazon, you know, ones that my dad uses. My dad drives everything like a bouncer. At least I slow down enough sometimes to do rock crawling things and then drive like a bouncer, but my dad beats the dog snot out of these freaking drive shafts. This girl breaks them. So, <clears throat> after, let's see, two motors, an ESC, a front axle, just old school SCX 10 ones, and a transmission, I took all that out and I built her basically a bolt what i thought was bulletproof a bulletproof scx 10 one she's not as into it as my son is she goes to be with me he goes because he likes it so i gave her a capable truck but didn't go crazy because i know she's maybe gonna comp once or twice she'll say she's done because she doesn't like being in front of the people and then she'll roll out so what i did was ssd scx 10s just some i think these are wraith shocks in the back these might be t-max or scx 10 shocks in the front i'm not sure what they are ssd cases pretty sure they're underdriven front and rear they have rc four-wheel drive knuckles uh c they're vanquish no i'm sorry they're vanquish knuckles c hubs lockouts it's i mean it's a nice truck and uh it worked okay and she broke the drive shafts and it they're both that one snapped you can see that snapped all the way off just it didn't even like it didn't even come out she broke it the pin like just and she doesn't even i don't know what she does i don't know i wish i could tell you she doesn't do anything crazy but like it's like she just looks at it and goes hey go and it just explodes you might as well cut on fire so i took everything off that and it's now in this this is the lc70 i was telling you about earlier TRX4 has cantilevers in the rear, which I, hey, they squeak a lot. I'm not 100% sold on. I don't know that I like them, but it is what it is. So just a hobby wing, another truck with a battery in it because I'm super responsible and I take all of those stack of batteries that I found now in trucks. Anyway, 
uh, crawl master, trail master, sorry, these are trail masters. Trail master sport does have a DSM from when I had it. I kept the bumper on it. Everything really lined up. I've got to put a little more Velcro back here so that it sticks, but this is now her truck because I couldn't break this going rock racing. We did like, um, we went up to Rochester, we did like a straight line rock race, drag race thing. And I only got beat by a guy in, he was in a bomber with two twos and Mickey Thompson Bajas. Yeah, uh, this is supposed to be a scale truck race. Everyone there has one nines and this dude brought out some two two bomber and just waxed everybody. I mean, the rocks were as almost as big as all the tires and stuff. And uh, you know what? It's fine. There was no money on the line. It's fine. My my pride was just hurt a little bit because didn't necessarily go with the spirit of the event. But it's fine. It's okay. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Just gotta keep telling myself I'm not mad. I'm not mad. It's fine. So, <clears throat> anywho, gave this to her. It works great. I haven't broke it. If she breaks it, I don't know. I guess I'll buy her a brick and put some wheels on it because that's the only thing she won't break. I guess, I, guess, I don't know. So that's it. So that's my kid's stuff. That's uh, some TRX4 stuff. Pretty much everything that we've done that. And uh, we're almost done with all the things and you're almost caught up. Next, we'll do some comp trucks and that will be the next video. But for now, I appreciate you, 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 and if you're watching, you and you and you, all those other people in the room, I appreciate you. Or if you're watching on your phone, just you. You're just, you, I appreciate you. Because, you know what? If you don't watch this, then it's pretty much useless. And I'm just out in the garage. Like I've said, freezing my ass off for no reason. So, like, subscribe. Like, what? 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 Like, share, subscribe. Do all those things you're supposed to be doing. You know the drill. Please do it. If you have anybody say, hey, you know, send them my way. Just be like, hey, this guy's, I mean, he's ugly, but it's fine. He does cool things. So we're going to get into some building stuff after I do one more of these. You guys have a wonderful day. I will check you later.